Hey guys, it's Gina Kramer from Cruise Critic, and I'm on board Royal Caribbean Symphony of the Seas, the biggest cruise ship in the world. Do you recognize where I am? Symphony of the Seas offers a mix of Royal Caribbean staples and new to the line features, like this reimagined boardwalk. Similar to other Oasis class ships, the boardwalk on this ship has a Coney Island vibe with a carousel and a handful of places to grab boardwalk inspired bites and drinks. Let's go check out what's new. First up is Playmakers, a sports bar and arcade open for lunch and dinner. This casual a la carte gastropub offers indoor and outdoor seating and a wide variety of comfort foods, such as burgers, loaded potato skins, and popcorn shrimp. While the arcade presents its own opportunities to get competitive, cruisers also can challenge themselves to a wing eating contest. Entering costs a fee, but those who can vacuum down 100 wings in 45 minutes get a t-shirt and bragging rights. Priceless. Another new to the boardwalk venue is Sugar Beach, with all the candy and ice cream your heart could desire. Bag some loose candy to go, or grab your favorite flavor ice cream or sundae for a boardwalk stroll. Bear in mind, treats do cost extra. If you're familiar with any of Symphony of the Seas sister ships, Oasis of the Seas, Allure of the Seas, or Harmony of the Seas, then chances are you've heard of the Aqua Theater. While not much has changed about the Aqua Theater itself, the one on Symphony of the Seas puts on all new shows, which take high diving acrobatics to the next level. Expect to get splashed if you're in the front row. Outside the new additions, the boardwalk retains its easygoing vibe and sense of childlike charm, with staples like Johnny Rockets, Boardwalk Doghouse, and of course, the carousel. You're never too old to go for a spin. Come see Symphony of the Seas for yourself. <laughs>